There are events which happen once but last forever. It happened in Cadiz 200 years ago. It's the bicentenary of the first Spanish constitution proclaimed in Cadiz in 1812. The parliament which drew it up had been constituted two years earlier in Real Isla de León, San Fernando. The advance of the French army drove it to Cadiz, where it found a home in the oratory of San Felipe Neri. On the 19th of March, 1812, it proclaimed the new constitution, which would be key to the development of 19th century Europe and the Americas. In the midst of the Spanish War of Independence against the Napoleonic invasion, the text of the Constitution became the model for the demands for freedom of the people of both continents. The Constitution of 1812 laid the foundations for a new political and social regime. It included national sovereignty, the division of powers, freedom of the press, the abolition of the Inquisition, the division into provinces and the first legislation on human rights. Thus, the Cadiz Constitution became a political, ideological and legal benchmark for the independence of the new American nations. The influence of the Cadiz Constitution in Europe is less well known. However, it was translated into different languages such and inspired constitutional texts in different territories as Naples, Portugal, Piedmont and Russia. From Finland to Portugal, from Russia to Italy, the Cadiz text was a subject for study, reflection and debate. The Constitution was no longer Spanish, it had become universal. All of this means the bicentenary is very important to the University of Cadiz. UCA aspires to be the University of the Bicentenary. It has been working towards this goal for years. In 2004, with the Oceanica 2012 project of ideas, and in 2009, with a bicentenary master plan including activities, resources, and specialist researchers. UCA, which manages the University Portal of the Bicentenaries and the Ibero-American Aula Universitaria, has planned a wide-ranging set of commemorations in the academic, scientific, educational, cultural and international spheres. For 2012, it plans a project with five major areas of interest, with 81 programs, containing more than 600 activities and with an estimated participation of more than 130,000 people. And we are involving the university community and society in general in all our activities. The events will involve our four campuses, Cadiz, Jerez, Puerto Real and Algeciras, and the 15 centres where we teach 41 first degree and 34 postgraduate courses, with more than 1,200 professors, nearly 20,000 students and administration and service personnel. UCA will be a vital part of the Bicentenary and support the actions of other institutions. We must continue studying, researching and teaching about these historic events which still resonate today. And we want to do this with the help of everyone, working in every possible field. This is the legacy we have inherited and which we want to pass on. Welcome to the Bicentenary of the 1812 Constitution of Cadiz. Welcome to Cadiz. Welcome to UCA, the University of the Bicentenary. <laughs>